hello everyone so today we are going to implement running away from danger behavior for this civilian character so this white guy over there you see is a civilian so he doesn't have any weapons if i shoot he runs away from the direction that he heard the noise and then it stays there and if i move over here now he is changing the location because he's always trying to take cover from me because he identifies uh, the player as the threat okay. he's going over there and hiding and if i shoot again see he's running again away from the player so in case he find a cover now i'm dead so in case he can't find a cover he will just keep running away from me so that's what happening here and the same will apply for all the civilians we have in the level and to achieve this behavior we will be using a environment query or a EQS to find locations that the civilian can take cover from the location of the threat and before we get started i'd like to remind you you can download the project files of this project and all other thousands of projects that we have done in the channel to the date there are over 1700 videos and for each video you can access the project file once you become a member in the patron page without a limit and let's get back to today's video all right so this is what we have as of the end of course into crouching mode like duck to be safe that's basically what happens so at the moment he does not have a behavior that finds the cover so here is the ai civilian we don't have much here and this is the behavior tree so here now before he goes to the crouching mode what i want to do is find a cover location and run in there run into that location and crouch that's what i want him to do so for that we actually already have implemented a eqs or a environment query to find cover locations for the shooting ai here what it does is trace to eqs locked actor on visibility and distance to courier and here we have some let me open this so yeah it's basically taking the locked actor and we are calling it like this if the shoot this is uh, bt shooting behavior tree shooting if in the offensive mode uh, the ai system look for the closest cover in, in the defensive mode it looks for a cover a bit uh, that is away from the current target and this here the locked actor is considered for these calculations which is defined here eqs context locked actor which get the locked actor from the courier actor that means the npc ai and then using this bpi ai controller we get the reference to the locked actor i have already explained these steps for step by step from scratch in previously when we work on the shooting behavior so i'm not going to go into details i'm just giving you an overview how these things are implemented so what if you want you can go back to shooting ai episodes that we implemented in the series and brush up your knowledge so but for this ai civilian we haven't implemented this get locked actor to implement this we need to implement clm bpi ai controller i have already that interface in my project therefore let's go to class settings and add clm bpi ai controller now under interfaces we got get locked actor so we don't have a variable to keep the locked actor for now so let's promote this to a variable as locked actor now for the air controller what locked actor going to be is 
whoever the actor that is responsible for creating this uh, threat which we identify here so that means here I'll set locked actor as this actor whoever the actor responsible for this uh, noise perceived by the perception system right now we can use this EQS cover for the civilian so let me go back here BT shooting and copy this we don't need this decorator so let me just delete that and then call it like this make sure that we have given the blackboard key move to location because that's what we are updating so that we can move our AI character into that location approach and then let's add the delay for random number of minutes seconds between 3 to 7 all right I think that's all we have to do so let's test this yeah see go, go, go. he ran go, away go, 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 go. Fire. okay I got shot so now I don't think he will run away because threat is already killed all right so that's how you implement the running away behavior for the NPCs and once again when the threat is cleared, go, he's go, hiding go. over there. Go, go, go. Now, if I go, go, go. don't make any more noises for a while, he's returning. So you can change the timing, of course, to make it more believable. But the behavior is there. All right, so we can stop this episode right here. So thanks for watching. Updated pretty files will be available for the download link would be in the description below and feel free to let me know what else you guys want me to cover for this uh, Civilian behaviors and see you in the next episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Goodbye